What's up, gamers? It's your boy, Launchpad 1412. Excited to be back with some Madden 20 gameplay here. We got the Alphabet Series popping off here. We got the Pittsburgh Steelers. And before I get into it, I know you guys get on me a lot about not putting my plugs in early enough. So here it is. Follow me on Twitter, Snapchat, and Instagram at Launchpad 1412. You can also follow me on Twitch. I'm streaming about two to three times a week. I try to at least. It could be difficult some weeks, but I try to get it in. Last time on the last stream, we actually had a classic. It was a really, really good game. Uh, so you definitely don't want to miss it in this case it happens again, which is probably uh, most likely going to happen more often than not because I'm good at the game, but not necessarily great at the game. I'm just good enough to whether, whether I'm just good good enough to where you're never going to know whether I'm going to win or lose. But you can follow me there at twitch.tv slash launchpad FT1412. I'm not sorry, FT12. I'm sorry. <laughs> Take the 14 out. FT12. And um, it would be awesome. And I would love to get affiliated as soon as possible. I have 14 um, followers. If I get 50 followers, I believe I get affiliated quite quickly. I'm, I'm like, it's like four goals you got to hit. I got two of them down already. So if you guys can help your boy out with that, that would be awesome, man. But at any rate, let's get into this game, man. As you can see, we're up seven already. He goes deep. I thought we had to pick here with Fitzpatrick. He usually doesn't miss those type of picks. I've played with the Steelers probably about three or four times this year. Um, not that many. Um, there's no specific reason. I usually play with them more often. I, I guess because um, because they were so bad in a regular season, they just wasn't a team on my radar for whatever reason. As a <laughs> Smith Schuster catches a tough um, catch right there, but I can see we're cooking with gas, man. We, we pretty much have the advantage. Our third down to go. All we gotta do is get a score right here. But oh my goodness. Somebody get him. Nobody gets him. And JJ Watt gets a scoop of score all the way to the Baja. I'm like, man, you've got to be kidding me, man. You hate to see it, man. But, <laughs> but this is what I tell you guys about Madden, though. The thing of it is, the momentum can switch at any time. So when you go into these Madden games, you got to have your mind mentally prepared. Like, you really, really got to have your mind mentally prepared for anything because you never know. Now, this guy's got, he's got the momentum. He just sacked me not too long ago. Even though we do get the first down right there on the fourth and sixth. I mean, that, that was a really good play. Good catch uh, by 13. But he's, he's still got you know, more momentum than what he would have if we'd have had that score. You never know. We could have got a went up 14 to nothing or 10 to nothing. Get an interception that's 17 or 21. And that could have forced a quit. We could have been about here real quick <laughs> all 10 the next game. Because we're trying to win as many games as possible. You know, we're, we're 26 and 1. But, you know, we're trying to go 21-6-1. You know, we don't want to lose any games. But because of that one play, this game turned into a grinder. And you got to have your mind prepared for that. Because games are where it looks like you got the clear cut victory. Um, the victory luck is going to be easy. It's within your grasp. It's within great range. And all of a sudden, that, that feeling is taken away from you. And now you're, now you're in a grinder. And this is where we're at right here, right in the meat grinder. So, it's all good. We've been here 150 million times. This is not anything new to us. He gets a score right here. He's actually in the lead. Can you even believe this right now? He's in the lead. I'm like, man, you've got to be kidding me. You know, we're kind of in the we're kind of in the pressure cooker. We just threw a pick right there, and he really, really has all the momentum. But check out what happens right here. 18 seconds left to go before the half is over with. He doesn't get that, thank goodness. But you know, he does get this. He gets this with fails of all people. I mean, I was like, okay. But check out the time. Two seconds left. Why he doesn't kick the field goal, I don't know. I <laughs> really don't know. And I don't even care because 14 to 10 looks way better than 17 to 10 right now. I'm thinking to myself as this half is going on, um, I know his confidence is high. His confidence is pretty high. He's got some momentum. We get a score right here. We get a stop. And I think we can pretty much win this game. That's my mentality going in into the half. We're at his crib. So that's something else you got to. Keep in mind, that was a bad pass. I had another guy wide open. I was really, really upset with myself when I didn't get that, but it's all good. First down to 10. My opponent goes to the right. We almost sack him, and look at this. I'm like, man, you've got to be kidding me. Look at what luck. So we ended up hitting him with this. It's your boy, but we don't score on that, but that was a huge play right there. I'll definitely take it, man. We were down four. We want to go up right there over the middle. Oh, my goodness. I didn't see him. Luckily, he had bad timing on that interception. He bats that one down. And we're forced to kick a field goal. But look what happens, man. Look at the meter. All of a sudden, the meter just glitched out on me. I'm like, what in the world happened? I'm like, you got to be kidding me. 
I like, oh my goodness. What else can happen in this game? This guy gets an in, not, not interception, but a fumble recovery. And this is Ben Roethlisberger we're talking about. This is one of the toughest quarterbacks in the league. This guy doesn't fumble the ball that much. But if you can believe this, I think within the last 20 games, he, like he's one of the few quarterbacks that's, I, that I fumbled with. I mean, you could you, maybe you can go back and look at the games, but you know the quarterbacks don't fumble that much. Of all the quarterbacks, Ben Roethlisberger will fumble. And that would lead to a, a, a touchdown. And now this guy is up 14 <laughs> to 10 with the opportunity to go two possessions. The nerve did a first down and run it with Deshaun Watson <laughs> and not fumble, man. My goodness, man. So third down and one. We stuff him right there. Thankfully, we forced him to kick a field goal because this guy could have went for it. He could have went for it. He could have got it. That would have been 21 to 10. That would have been definitely a little bit more devastating than 17 to 10. Well, take it. We go to the left hand side and oh boy, we get lucky right there. He probably should have had the big. The pick, I don't know what the heck I'm saying. The pick, <laughs> he should have had a pick, but sometimes it's better to be lucky than good. It's your boy. We get a beautiful catch right there. First down to 10. We we'll see the boy one on one on the left hand side, and we take full advantage. Good catch by Washington, man. And we'll take that all day, all night, and all even with 15 to 52 seconds left to go into the game. Look at this, man. The field goal glitched on me again. I'm like, you've got to be kidding me. I like of all the things that could happen, the field goal just I, it, it just it just glitched on me. I don't know, I don't even know what to even say. The only thing I can say is I wish I had my my mutt kicker, <laughs> my nine five overall Orlando Mir, Orlando Mir, I believe that's his name. It doesn't miss a field goal, but this well, I mean it's rare that I miss field goals on this game, but I mean it's rare that any of us should be missing field goals at this juncture of the game. But every once in a while, the field goal would glitch on me, and it did twice to, to be to me twice in this game. That first one was horrific because it was just like I don't even know what happened. You know, somehow the way it looked, it indicated I hit the meter early, which was not the case. <laughs> I remember it clear that that was not the case. But it is what it is, man. You're bold. <laughs>